Hey, 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 Leo. This is your sacred scribe here, ready to do your reading. So let's see what's up for you, Leo. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe right down below there, Leo. I appreciate. Okay, so we have the Hermit, the Seven of Pentacles. What else? What else do we have? The tower. A lot of you guys are having a tower moment. The five of cups. I feel like that's the tower moment. I feel like um, something from your past is popping up here. Somebody from your past. Okay. Hmm. But I also feel like you're investing or you will be investing your time in something and nurturing something. And while you're doing that, that's when this comes in. You may have been in hermit mood. Yeah, king of pentacles. So you've been focusing on your money, on your coin here. For some of you, you could be dealing with a Taurus, but I feel like this is you. Could be Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn or Virgo with the hermit energy. You may go into Hermit Road when this tower happens. Knight of Wands. Yeah, so whatever you're doing for money, Leo, you love doing it. And this person that's coming back from the past, hmm, they may have been a player slash playette. Maybe this is why you're going into Hermit Mode. Yeah, somebody may want a reunion here with Judgment. The Six of Wands. This person has quite the ego. I'm feeling Leo. <laughs> quite the ego. What is their intention? Two of Wands. They want to move things forward with you. They want to put the past behind you guys. And they want to push forward. Okay, I feel like, whoa, Four of Wands, they want a commitment. What do you think about this person coming back? The Magician, this could be a Gemini. What do you think about this person coming back? Five of Pentacles. You've been feeling left out in the cold by this person. Okay, so I, I feel like you have mixed feelings over this person coming back okay on the one hand it's like yes we could manifest something together together we can create something new but you're thinking about this five of pentacle energy why is the five of pentacles here yeah two of cups they you just felt felt left out in the cold you felt it's like you know you can be in a relationship and feel lonely Right? And this is what I'm feeling that you were feeling in this relationship. And I feel like you invested a lot of time and energy in this. And now you're investing in ooh, a possible Taurus or Libra here with the Empress. Ten of Cups. So Leo, this person may come in when there's a new person on your arm here. So they may see this empress and their ego. That's why I was feeling the ego. Their ego is like, oh no, Leo would be there if I came back. Ace of Cups. So this person is new. Okay. This person that you're going to be investing your time into this empress or emperor. It's just feminine energy. Okay, there's a lot of, there's, there's a strong emotional connection here. It, even intuitive. Okay, there's a lot of uh, water energy that I'm picking up between you. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Very intense, but intense on a, a psychic level. That's what I'm feeling. Intense on a psychic level. Oof. Five of Cups, Nine of Swords. So this person's going to come back and you're going to, it's going to make you anxious. 
it's going to make you a little anxious, Leo. So be prepared. Okay, try not to overthink. Just look at what's in front of you and what's being offered and look in your heart. Queen of Pentacles. Look at what you want to build. What is the world? What is the life that you want to build? And who fits into this life? Who fits into it? You're going to know this intuitively. I feel like you will. Page of Wands. I feel like, Leo, you're excited about this new person. I don't feel... Even though you have mixed feelings about this old person coming back... I feel like you can't deny the connection here with this new individual. Yeah. The Wheel of Fortune is clarifying the tower. Now, what I'm feeling with the tower is not only this new person coming back, but this new individual, uh, sorry, this old person coming back, the new individual entering your life, right? And it's like the timing, it's perfect timing even though it may seem chaotic, I'm getting like this may seem when you meet this person, it may seem like a chaotic time in your life, possibly the world. Maybe there's chaos that'll be happening. I mean, we're already living in, in chaos, right? But I feel like, um, like in future chaos, because I know it's coming, but the future chaos to come is like when you're meeting. Yeah, you have a decision to make. You will have a decision to make with justice here. This person could be a Libra. You have the justice card and the Empress, but it really could be any sign. Two of Swords. Yeah, you've got to get out of your head. You've got to get into your heart here, Leo. Okay, you're highly intuitive. And to boot this they, that keeps pulling me in i gotta get some more cards over here tell me about this um spiritual connection or the psychic connection look at this the moon page of pentacles i told you deep intuitive level here you may even keep this person secret from oh no is this a secret this person may be kept secret from somebody, but I feel like, because I was feeling like this person knew or will know about this new person coming in, unless they too are intuitive and they can feel that cord being plucked away from them. You know how that happens, Leo, right? When they feel that, it's like, oop, got to come back. They can't let me go. Clarify the moon. This may be a twin. I don't have the sun here, but four of cups. You don't want to miss this opportunity with this person here. You don't want to be disappointed at the decision that you make. There is an angel looking over this. This absolutely could be twin flame here. Divine counterpart, however you want to look at this. Why is temperance here? Queen of Wands. See? Magical union here. So I feel like patience is needed. Because you have patience twice here. Is needed to nurture this new relationship, okay? And as far as this old relationship goes, I feel like you need to listen to your intuition big yes on that one okay and get out of your head as well how does this empress feel about leo i'm getting a lot of energy man the the world they feel like uh -huh. they feel like you are their world like their new world i want to say They could be at a distance. Two of Pentacles. Ugh. 
they see you as a major multitasker here. Like, look at this. Uh, and this two of pentacles, right? Lifted weights with his arms, lifted weights with his feet here. They see you as a multitasker. Nine of pentacles. They, they see you as somebody that's strong and that stands in their power, that knows who they are, I'm getting. That's very abundant, very autonomous, right? They have a, I'm feeling respect and admiration. That's what I'm feeling. Wow. So what is your advice for Leo? What's your advice? Six of Pentacles. Now, for me as a reader, that can be given to two people. You got to find out wh where is your balance, and I and I also feel like this is saying, yeah, take your time and make sure that you're balanced before making this decision here, Leo. Yep, be patient. You patience three times, three times. Seven of Pentacles, Temperance, and Three of Wands. Okay, because your ships are coming in. But what are your ships? That's what you have to ask yourself. Okay, what kind of boat are you building, Leo? Let's get you an advice card from the Oracle. Manifestation. Soon you may manifest the goal you focus spiritual energies upon. Told ya. That's what I was feeling. Strong spiritual connection. Strong psychic connection. I want to say psychic connection again. But you can manifest whatever you want. And this is exactly how this person sees you, Leah. Like a magician. Okay. Oh. And. And. Transformation. Allow the energy of fear to be transformed by love, creativity, and compassion. And that is awesome, awesome advice because of this head energy that you have, okay, with this nine of swords, all right? So get back into love, get back into creativity, okay, and compassion, all you have to do, Leo, is create and have fun. That's who you are anyway, and it'll take you out of this anxiety, okay? All right, Leo, I hope that resonated. If you're interested in a private reading, link is in the description box below to my Etsy shop. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Also, subscribe to my new channel, Nature Speaks 333, where I channel messages from the trees to you the collective humanity so you have a good one and i'll catch you on the flip side on the dailies namaste